Zone 7 Gardening Virtual Plant Clinics highlight native and other plants suited to grow well on our Mid-Atlantic USDA Hardiness Zone 7 Gardens. The Zone 7 Garden Series of Plant Clinics is sponsored by the Virginia Cooperative Extension Program of Virginia's two land-grant universities, Virginia Tech and Virginia State University. Gardening zones were developed by the USDA to help growers understand which plants are most likely to thrive at a particular minimum temperature. You can see this USDA plant hardiness map is based on the average annual minimum winter temperature for a zone, which helps gardeners to select plants that will most likely thrive in their zone. Zone seven is shown in light green, which includes our region of Virginia. Most of Fairfax County is in zone 7A, except for a small portion adjacent to the Potomac River. So here's 7A, and here's the small portion right here, which is, which is 7B. Here in zone seven, we have milder winters without the extremes of cold in the zones to the north of us and the extremes of heat in the zones to our south. Placing our gardens in a transition zone between these two extremes. Note, the last spring frost for zone 7A is 15 April through 25 April. And zone 7B is 5 April through 15 April. Though we've been known to have a late frost like we did last year around Mother's Day. In Fairfax County, are we zone 7A or are we zone 7B? Well, most of us are in zone 7A. So the a website for the USDA hardiness zone. You just put your zip code in there and it pops up with uh, your zone and a color in it. And so take a look at that website. And just revisit the frost dates for uh, the, the two zones in, in the, um, I think we saw that zone 7A was somewhere between April 15th and April 25th. So that would apply to most of us, correct? Correct, correct. And then zone 7B right along the Potomac. So if you're down there around uh, Mount Vernon, Alexandria, somewhere around there, it's uh, April 5th through 15 April. 